Developing tonight, despite COVID-19 pandemic, the Greater Beaumont Chamber of Commerce says the Southeast Texas economy is maintaining a steady pace. The chamber only tracks businesses that are members, but it says almost all are staying afloat. KFDM's Rocio De La Fay reports which businesses took a pretty hard hit and what the chamber expects in the coming months. Good news for the Southeast Texas economy. Out of the more than 1,000 members that make up the Greater Beaumont Chamber of Commerce, only three businesses have had to close in the past three months due to COVID-19. It is a, a low number. Vice President of Economic Development Anna Pareda says restaurant and personal serving businesses took the brunt of the pandemic's economic fallout. It is not surprising. Most of them were in the hospitality industry, which was the one who was most affected by the pandemic. But it, it's not but it's also not so bad. Pareda says at least 10 businesses won't be renewing their membership, largely due to the economic strain endured during the pandemic. And most of them were just trying to cut costs. They are working on their budget. Despite the loss of members, the Chamber of Commerce maintains a 91% retention rate. Pareda says Governor Abbott's latest reopening phase gave the greater Beaumont economy the boost it needed. So far, we are in the right track, and we've seen in the past month in the past three weeks, um, more movement in the economy. So that is good. Peretta also credits a thriving real estate industry and at-home construction projects during the pandemic that helped keep the economy running. Well, that helped a little bit with, uh, with retail, with sales tax, because people were spending, since they were spending so much time at home, they decided to remodel the bathroom or the kitchens. Overall, the Chamber of Commerce expects the economy to grow in the months ahead, and it's confident more jobs will be created to support a growing region. In Beaumont, Rosia Delafay, KFDM 6 News.